Welcome to Grade 4 Mathematics, Quarter 3, Week 2. After going through this lesson, you will develop skills that you need in geometry. 1. Use protractor as a device for measuring and drawing angles. 2. Characterize triangles and quadrilaterals using concrete objects or models. So type in your chat box the letter of the correct answer. Each number you have 20 seconds to do it. Let's start. Number one. So what is a protractor? Your 20 seconds starts now. <laughs>
Here are the correct answers. Did you get five correct answers? If you do, very good. Next lesson. Describing the attributes or properties of triangles and quadrilaterals using concrete objects or models. A polygon is a closed figure which is made up of several line segments that are joined together. The line segments are called sides and do not cross each other. There are exactly two sides that meet at a point. A triangle is a polygon with three sides and three angles. Below are models in a triangular shaped figure. A quadrilateral means four sides. Quad means four. Lateral means side. It is a four-sided polygon with four angles like rectangle, square, parallelogram, trapezoid, and rhombus. Below are some models in a quadrilateral shape. So this is a rectangle. This one is a square. This is a trapezoid. This is a parallelogram. And this one is a rhombus. Remember, an angle is formed when two rays meet at a common endpoint. The common endpoint of the two rays is called vertex. An angle is measured in degrees by a device called protractor. A polygon is a closed shape with straight sides. Triangle and quadrilaterals are examples of polygon. Triangles can be classified according to angles. Acute angle is an angle that measures less than 90 degrees. Right angle is an angle that measures exactly 90 degrees. Obtuse angle is an angle that measures more than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees. A protractor is a device used to measure an angle. A triangle is a polygon with three sides and three angles. A quadrilateral is a polygon with four sides and four angles. It can be classified as a square, a rhombus, a rectangle, a parallelogram, and a trapezoid. 